Hey there, how you doing? Welcome back to another refined storage video. Today we're going to be looking at crafters using refined storage to auto craft. Yeah, but you're going to need a crafter. This output can be based towards a type of processing block to put that block into processing. But if I wanted to get iron the processor, I would need to attach a crafter here. And then I'm also going to need a pattern grid. Pattern grids are going to allow us to craft a certain thing. You're also going to need actual patterns. So we're going to do exact. So this is going to be the exact item. I'm going to need exactly nine cobblestone to make one compressed. I can take that, pop that into a crafter that's not facing anything. So now when I go to my grid, the compressed cobblestone crafting option is going to come up. And that's going to, so I want to say, I want to make 10 compressed cobble. That's going to show how much cobblestone I need. So I'm going to need 90. It's going to craft that for me. It does it pretty quickly. There you go, 10 compressed cobble. When a crafter is facing an object, you can then, it unlocks the processing. So if I want to put iron here, iron, so I can also, don't need the items, I can drag it from um, JEI. So that it inputs iron ore, outputs it. So I can now go to the earnest crafter. So now the refined storage system is inputting iron um, to the iron furnace the coal ore and it's outputting iron ingots. If I really wanted to automate this further, I could grab a exporter, add items, I'm going to hook up iron fan system, tell it to put coal to this. This is going to accept fuel put from it is now going to slowly uptick as it transports coal from the system into this iron furnace and it'll do that till it's maxed. In order to truly... So I've, it's made my 10 iron for me. I need to put it back into the system. It's an porter. Now that's going to drain the system. And now I have my 10 iron. And that's... And I can do that pretty much forever. It can get incredibly complex because it reads itself. So if I want to set this to make automatically make iron pickaxes, I would take a pattern, I'd put it, take a pattern, make it here, make it there, I'd either have sticks or I'd have another pattern to make sticks out of oak planks and they will daisy chain off each other. That's how you, that's the long way of using autocrafter, or a crafter. I hope you found this video useful and see you the rest of your day with a smile.